Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Jerry Views back with another video and today we're talking about updating the firmware on your AirPods or AirPods Pro. As you probably know, there is no like direct way to do that. There is no button that you can press to actually update your AirPods. But finally, we have like a tutorial by Apple, which lets us know the steps that we need to follow in order to update to the latest firmware for AirPods and AirPods Pro. As you probably have seen a lot of times, there will be releases of new updates for the AirPods, but you probably don't even know how to actually update them. And now I will show you guys how to do that. It's actually very, very simple. Now, if this tutorial, according to Apple, if it doesn't work, then you will have to actually reset your AirPods and start again from the beginning. I will show you guys also how to reset your AirPods in a minute here. But first of all, let's talk about how to actually update your AirPods. Now, these steps that Apple has shown us, we used these even before, but I think the trick here is the amount of time that you need for the firmware to update on our AirPods. That's what probably has been going wrong all the time because most users would actually have a really, really hard time updating their AirPods. But let's just go ahead and first off, let me show you the first step. Now, the first step, pretty simple. You need your AirPods to be in Bluetooth range with your iPhone, your iPad, or your Mac, whichever one you're using. And of course, that Mac, that iPhone or iPad needs to be connected to the Wi-Fi. Once you have that done, then make sure that you put both AirPods in the case and close the lid. Now with the lid closed, plug in the charger on your AirPods case and then plug it to charge. Whether that will be an adapter or your Mac, whatever it is, it doesn't matter. Now, once you have done that, you will have to leave your AirPods like that for at least 30 minutes. A lot of people will do that, maybe just keep it for 10 minutes. You'd need at least 30 minutes for your AirPods to be charging and connected to your iPhone, your, iPod, your iPad, or your Mac. And once you have done that, then you can go ahead and reconnect your AirPods to your iPhone, your Mac, or your iPad, and then it should actually be updated. Now, of course, you can go ahead and check the version to see if it has been updated. To do that, it's pretty simple. You just go to your settings, tap on your AirPods, they will be at the top of your settings app. And then from here, you will be able to actually check the firmware on your AirPods. Just go ahead and go down here. They will have the version. You have the version for the case and the, the version right here for your AirPods. That's the version of the firmware that you have installed on your AirPods. Now, as I said at the beginning of the video, according to Apple, if this doesn't work, then you will need to reset your AirPods and try it again. Now, here is how you can reset your AirPods. First of all, what you need to do is go to your iPhone and go to your Bluetooth section. Just tap the I button where you see the name of your AirPods. And then from here, just make sure you forget this device. So you disconnect, disconnect basically this device from your iPhone. Once you have done that, you make sure you just place your AirPods on the case here, close the lid for 30 seconds. Then if you have the AirPods 4 or whichever AirPods that have the button on the front, open the lid and then just tap three times on the button on the front and you will see that amber flashlight. That means that your AirPods have been reset. If you have the case with a button on the back here, the AirPod Pro 2s right here, you go ahead and again, close the lid for 30 seconds, then tap and hold this button until you see the flash here, just the amber color, just flashing right there, and then it will turn white. That means that you have now reset it, your AirPods, and then you can try again to actually update your AirPods to the latest firmware. So that's basically it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did and subscribe for more. And I will see you on the next one.